toward me. All right. Well, no, 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 no. Don't move from where you were. Okay. Now, Commissioner, this event here, what does it mean to the city and the fundraising for the Kelowna Club? Well, more importantly, the fundraising is bringing our people together to, from our Hispanic community. It's the first time we've ever done anything for our Hispanic community, which is 22% now, and we're having a ball. We know how to throw a party. From the turnout, it uh, looks like you've done real well. I expect about 500 people to show up at, at the turn of the event. And the sandwich, what are you going to do with that? Well, the sandwich will be cut up in four inch pieces and boxed and sold for $2 at the end of the event to help raise money for the Kiwanis Club. Okay, now you had, how did you pull all of the uh, restaurants together for this? I did a lot of groundwork of walking, talking, calling the phone, visiting them. Uh, we had a few restaurants that kind of bailed out because they really didn't understand what we were doing. Since we've never done anything in the Hispanic community, there were some of them were a little uh, hesitant to join in. Okay, Alejandro, A-L-E-J-A-N-D-R-O. Recio, R-E-C-I-O. Okay, now Alejandro, you made the, all of the bread for this. How did you guys get it done for this? Uh, well, we, we break bread every day. So it was just another day, add another 40 breads to, the, to what we make every day. So you have 40 different breads for this? Yeah, we have 40 loaves of Cuban bread. We have one gallon of pickles, half a gallon of mustard, and 51, 51 uh, pounds of meat. Uh, and, and cheese, and that would be ham, pork, and Swiss cheese. 